Temperance is the high mastery of voluntarily resisting instead of reacting. It is the art of making conscious decisions instead of impulsive ones. As the Stoic state, temperance is one of the four essential virtues alongside wisdom, justice and courage. It involves self-control and moderation, recognizing our limits and not letting our passions dominate us. It is the ability to remain calm in the face of challenges and respond in a balanced and measured way. In short, temperance is a balance, the moderation that permeates all aspects of life. This virtue is of great importance as it is key to our ability to make good decisions, especially under pressure, to maintain serenity and mental clarity and to effectively solve problems. If you are often controlled by your emotions, whether it's anger or enthusiasm, you face a serious issue of self-control, which is precisely why we turn to Stoicism to overcome this challenge. In this video, I want to be practical and direct. I will present 10 practical ways to apply the essential historical principles to cultivate temperance as one of your virtues. Lesson 1. Embrace what you can control. Epictetus, the Stoic sage, offers us a fundamental lesson that serves as the cornerstone of Stoic philosophy, the dichotomy of control. At the heart of this teaching is the recognition that our lives are subject to a fundamental division between elements we can control and those beyond our influence. This concept is pivotal in cultivating a calm and composed demeanor even in the midst of life's uncertainties. In essence, Epictetus advises us to invest our energy and attention in those aspects of life that fall within our sphere of control. These include our thoughts, actions, intentions and responses. By directing our focus to what is genuinely within our power, we can navigate life with a sense of purpose and mastery. It is the acknowledgement that our internal world is under our dominion that forms the bedrock of our tranquility. Conversely, external events and circumstances, which often elude our sway, are to be acknowledged as outside the realm of our control. Just as an archer, as exemplified by Epictetus, can aim carefully, draw the bowstring with precision, and release the arrows skillfully, yet remain uncertain of the flight's outcome. We must learn to release our attachment to outcomes we cannot govern. This release is not an act of resignation, but an embrace of equanimity in the face of life's inherent unpredictability. Epictetus's metaphor of the archer, who derives contentment from knowing they've exerted their best effort regardless of the target's fate, serves as a potent reminder of the stoic approach to life. It encourages us to concentrate on our intentions and the dedicated efforts we put forth, accepting that the results are subject to a multitude of external factors. In essence, Stoicism reminds us to seize the reins of our inner world, embracing the dichotomy of control as a powerful tool to maintain a calm and composed disposition in a world where much remains beyond our influence. By concentrating our energies on what we can shape, we free ourselves from the burden of attempting to govern the uncontrollable, allowing us to discover serenity in the knowledge that we've done our utmost with the tools at our disposal. Lesson 2. The Power of Acceptance In the grand tapestry of Stoic philosophy, few figures stand as tall as the Roman Emperor and philosopher Marcus Aurelius. His profound insights, often chiseled in the timeless monument of meditations, resonate through the ages and illuminate one of the most powerful lessons in Stoicism, the lesson of acceptance. Marcus Aurelius guides us through a profound exploration of the human condition, acknowledging the inevitability of both triumph and tribulation. Life, as he observes, is a symphony of ups and downs, a constant ebb and flow within this ever-shifting landscape. There exist circumstances beyond our influence, elements we cannot control. 
Marcus Aurelius, in his role as a Stoic sage, extols the virtue of accepting these immutable truths. To accept in the Stoic sense is to embrace the reality of life's unpredictability and impermanence. It is to release the chains of attachment to specific outcomes and to walk in harmony with the unceasing rhythm of the universe. In Marcus Aurelius's words, resistance to the natural course of events leads only to turmoil and distress, like a ship struggling against the relentless current. The Stoic perspective on acceptance is akin to setting sail on the sea of existence without a fixed destination, yet with an unwavering faith in the voyage itself. It is an invitation to relinquish the desire for unyielding control and instead flow with the ever-changing stream of life. To dance with the music of the cosmos, whether its notes are serene or tempestuous, it is the embodiment of Stoic temperance. In the realm of Stoicism, this lesson forms the bedrock of inner peace and tranquility. It urges us to open our arms to life's capriciousness, to savor the sweetness of success, and to weather the storms of adversity with grace. The power of acceptance as illuminated by Marcus Aurelius is a beacon that guides us through the labyrinth of existence, allowing us to greet each moment, each circumstance with an equanimous heart. It is the serenity of embracing life in all its unpredictability, finding profound serenity in the midst of its ever-shifting landscape. Lesson 3. Limit Excessive Desires in the splendid picture of Stoic philosophy, woven from threads of reason and ethics. Seneca's Conference on Stoic Principles of Moderation is a masterpiece in itself. A renowned philosopher known for profound philosophical essays on ethics and personal development, Seneca imparts to us an extremely important lesson. A lesson that invites us to control the fierce desires that often threaten to engulf our inner calm. At the heart of Stoic philosophy is the belief that excessive desires, like turbulent seas, have the potential to defeat our lives, leaving us in chaos and discontent. Stoic philosophers, in their steadfast pursuit of inner tranquility, recognized the danger of unbridled desire for wealth they saw that material wealth and possessions were beyond what is necessary for a virtuous and wise life. Seneca echoes the Stoic spirit, conveying his understanding based on the belief that true contentment often resides in the serene realm of limited desires. It is a lesson that encourages us to navigate the murky waters of existence with the helm of moderation, guiding us to the peaceful harbor within. The Stoic path, illuminated by Seneca's wisdom, invites us to simplify our desires, seeking only what is necessary for a life marked by goodness and ethics. In this simplicity, we discover the precious gems of contentment and tranquility, independent of the capricious winds of external fortune. The Stoic practice of restraining excessive desires becomes the guiding star for maintaining a posture of calm and serenity. It is within the walls of this classical wisdom that we uncover the profound truth that the pursuit of passion for external possessions is but a fleeting illusion and true treasures lie within waiting to be unearthed. Imagine having a prosperous life with a good job, a big house and wealth, but you always feel insufficient and want more. Stoic philosophy encourages focusing on the necessary and limiting excessive desires. Instead of chasing countless unnecessary things, you concentrate on goodness and ethics. As a result, you experience inner contentment and tranquility, not being caught up in the endless race for material possessions. This exemplifies how Stoicism helps keep life interesting and peaceful without constantly pursuing new things. Seneca's lectures stand as an enduring testimony to Stoicism's commitment to inner mastery and the moderation of desires, paving the path to the sacred sanctuary of inner peace. Lesson 4. Understand the transitory nature of life. 
Through the deep and eternal verses of Marcus Aurelius's Meditations, the Roman emperor and Stoic philosopher delved into the essence of life, a life filled with changes. His teachings serve as evidence of the wisdom of accepting the ever-changing nature, of existence as a foundation for maintaining a calm and tranquil state of mind. Through the lens of Stoic philosophy, Marcus Aurelius imparts a lesson that may be one of the most important points in achieving inner serenity. He invites us to embark on a philosophical journey related to recognizing the short-term and temporary aspects of life. Stoic awareness of this reality is often referred to as the transitory nature of life, not as a sign of despair, but as a foundation for profound strength in our lives. This lesson is the understanding that nothing in the realm of human experience, whether moments of joy or challenges of hardship, remains unchanged. The universe, in its relentless and ever-flowing nature, creates a tapestry of constant change. Stoic sages do not resist this cosmic dance. Instead, they embrace it with grace and wisdom. Marcus Aurelius calls on us to release the attachment to fleeting moments, much like the fleeting stars in the night sky and the material possessions we focus on for a short time. He teaches us to cherish moments and possessions when they come into our lives, but also to let them go when their time comes. In doing so, we discover an inner sanctuary, calm and serene, impervious to the storms outside. Accepting the transience of everything, as supported by Marcus Aurelius, is a remedy for the soul. It allows us to approach the changes in life with a sense of equanimity. It liberates us from the anxiety of clinging to what was and what could have been. Through this stoic lesson, we become architects of inner patience, constructing a unique fortitude in the face of life's inevitable changes. Imagine standing on a beach at a beautiful sunset. The sea calmly waves and the sun slowly disappears behind the horizon. According to Stoic philosophy, you understand that this moment is temporary. Instead of feeling sadness or attachment, you decide to fully embrace every moment of it without letting transience affect your soul. You appreciate the beauty of the sunset and let it go without holding on. In this way, you create a serene and enjoyable moment without being bound by the fear of losing it. You maintain a calm and tranquil state in your daily life. Understanding the transience of life opens the path to profound inner serenity. We realize that our ability to remain calm and composed transcends external circumstances. It is a sustainable presence much like the stars that continue to shine in the night sky, regardless of passing clouds. Marcus Aurelius, through his stoic wisdom, invites us to savor the light of this understanding, providing us with the opportunity to enjoy the moments of life while maintaining an invincible sense of peace. Lesson 5. Be Virtuous The essence of Stoicism is nurtured and cherished by great Stoic philosophers like Epicurus, Seneca, and Marcus Aurelius, rooted in a steadfast commitment to virtue. This commitment lies at the heart of this ancient philosophy. Stoic virtues, including wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance, serve as guiding stars, leading us to a life marked by inner tranquility and peace. In the rich tapestry of Stoic philosophy, virtues hold a sacred position. They are guiding moral stars that call upon us to navigate through life's storms with grace and wisdom. These virtues are not abstract concepts, but pillars upon which Stoic thought about living in harmony with the natural order of the universe is built. Wisdom, the first virtue in this list, plays the role of a shining beacon, illuminating the path of reason and discernment. It calls upon us to develop deep knowledge of the world and our place in it. Stoic philosophers like Epicurus understood that wisdom is the foundation upon which all other virtues are built. With wisdom as our guiding star, 
we have the ability to see the world as it truly is and distinguish between the transient and the eternal. Courage, the second virtue, stands as a guardian of the moral soul's achievements. It calls upon us to face life's challenges with determination and resolve. In the Stoic Dictionary, courage is not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it. It is a resolute determination to confront difficulties with inner strength. Seneca, through his lectures, extols the importance of courage in building a character marked by resilience and unwavering determination. Justice, the third virtue, drapes the mantle of righteousness on the Stoic path. It calls upon us to live by the principles of fairness and moral rectitude. Stoic philosophers draw inspiration from sources of justice, guiding us to make decisions based on fairness and morality. The pursuit of justice ensures that our actions align with the moral order of the universe, promoting inner serenity and tranquility. Temperance, the final virtue, serves as a guardian of moderation and self-control. It reminds us to control our desires because through temperance, we discover the gateway to true peace. Seneca, in his philosophical essays, emphasizes the importance of simplifying our desires and seeking only what is necessary for a virtuous life. In the moderation of desire, we uncover the source of inner calm, regardless of external circumstances. These virtues, praised by various Stoic philosophers, converge to create a life that embodies Stoic ideals. They serve as guiding stars, leading us through the storms of life with grace, wisdom, and enduring peace. By adhering to these virtues and allowing them to permeate our thoughts and actions, we maintain a calm and serene disposition, reflecting Stoic commitment to inner harmony and moral living. In the mosaic of Stoicism, these virtues are the radiant colors that create an image of a life lived in harmony with the eternal truth of the universe. Lesson 6. Choose your response. Epictetus revered his wisdom that has transcended hundreds of years, leaving us an invaluable lesson, the power of choice in our reactions. In Stoic philosophy, this lesson stands as an unyielding pillar a guiding lighthouse steering us through the turbulent seas of existence. Epictetus, with unwavering steadfastness, conveyed the truth that while the reign of external events may be beyond our control, the helm of our reactions remains firmly in our hands. He declared this to be the essence of Stoic wisdom. In the Stoic sanctuary, where tranquility and equanimity reign, the focal point of control lies clearly within. Stoic philosophy, a philosophy rooted in our dominion over life's diverse challenges. It is in this sacred space that Stoic virtues, wisdom, courage, justice and temperance become guiding stars, illuminating the path to inner peace. Epictetus, with his counsel, urges us to contemplate the nature of our judgments and reactions, especially in difficulty. It is through this self-examination that we awaken to the profound truth that we possess a sacred gift, the ability to consciously shape our responses to the myriad external events in life. The Stoic approach to right reactions to life's fluctuations is akin to a perfect stroke on the canvas of existence. It is the choice to accompany Stoic virtues, to face life's challenges with the wisdom of philosophers the courage of heroes, the justice of noble hearts, and the composure of those who tread the path of self-mastery. Imagine encountering a negative situation in your communication with others. They speak ill of you, and you feel anger. Instead of retaliating, you learn to control your reaction. You understand their positive aspects and remain calm, creating a more positive atmosphere in communication. Stoicism helps you maintain composure and build better relationships with others. The Stoic, imbued with the wisdom of Epictetus, is a fortress of inner peace impervious even to the fiercest storms. 
Through conscious choice and alignment with stoic virtues, we create a protective barrier, preserving our inner peace in the face of adversity. It is the clear call of the stoic to navigate the rugged paths of life with grace and resilience. For in the crucible of conscious choice, we find the enduring furnace of inner peace. Lesson 7. Practice Mindfulness Seneca, the venerable Stoic philosopher whose wisdom has transcended time, illuminated an important lesson for those seeking tranquility and self-mastery amidst the turbulence of life, the practice of mindfulness. In the Stoic lexicon, mindfulness is a compass guiding us to the shores of the present moment, offering refuge from the ceaseless waves of regret about the past and uncertainty about the future. Essentially, mindfulness is the art of living in the present, immersing ourselves in the current moment with deep awareness. It is the antidote to the ailment of rumination, the incessant churn of the mind over past sorrows and anxieties about the future. Seneca's teachings in the Stoic tradition call upon us to honor the beauty and depth of the present recognizing it as the only time that holds true existence. The practice of mindfulness as described by Seneca is not confined to extraordinary moments in life, but extends its embrace to the ordinary and mundane. It encourages us to observe the tapestry of life with a discerning eye, from the extraordinary to the seemingly insignificant. In doing so, we free ourselves from the suffocating grip of regret and the clutches of anxiety. This stoic mindfulness, a precious tool for preserving inner calm and clarity, acts as a bridge to the precious present, connecting us to the profound simplicity of the now. It is an art that grants us the ability to fully engage in our current circumstances, savoring each breath and appreciating the beauty that unfolds in every heartbeat. In the practice of mindfulness, we discover an eternal sanctuary where the soul finds peace, where inner tranquility is nurtured and self-mastery is honed amidst the swirling currents of life. Lesson 8. The Value of Gratitude In the profound tapestry of Stoic philosophy, woven from threads of wisdom and enduring patience exists a sparkling gem of profound knowledge, the value of gratitude. This lesson is advocated by Seneca, one of the famous Stoic philosophers. He illuminated the path to inner tranquility and happiness, regardless of life's challenges. It guides us to appreciate not only the successes of life, but also its difficulties. Through the lens of gratitude, we find contentment even in the face of adversity. Seneca, in essays dedicated to the concept of gratitude, earnestly extols its virtues. He urges us to shift our focus away from what we may lack and towards what we already have, to find solace in the present moment and embrace the often overlooked treasures. In this stoic practice, we discover a powerful tool for maintaining profound inner peace. The essence of Seneca's teachings on gratitude is a gentle reminder that gratitude is not dependent on the abundance of our possessions, but on our ability to recognize life's blessings in their diverse forms. In this way, gratitude is not merely a simple reaction to life's easy moments, but a profound acknowledgement that even amidst the storm, there is a refuge of peace. By cultivating gratitude, we recalibrate our relationship with life. We learn to see the extraordinary in the ordinary, to glean lessons from challenges, and to cherish the preciousness of each fleeting moment. Seneca encourages us to be content with the present, realizing that the treasures of life are not commodities to collect, but experiences to cherish. The value of gratitude as illuminated by Seneca is a guardian of inner peace. It teaches us to continually reflect on the blessings marked on our journey. Through this, we discover that gratitude is an alchemical elixir that transforms the basic elements of despair and longing into the gold of contentment and serenity. 
In moments of challenge, a heart steeped in gratitude does not falter. It finds strength even in adversity because it recognizes that life's trials are also its teachers. As Seneca reminds us, the Stoic spirit does not waver in the face of hardship. Instead, it flourishes, drawing nourishment from gratitude's deep well. In the Stoic tradition, the value of gratitude is an ever-present companion that leads us to profound inner peace. It lifts us above the tumultuous waves of life, revealing the serenity found in embracing blessings, no matter how small or seemingly insignificant. With Seneca's wisdom, we come to realize that practicing gratitude is not a simple reaction to life's joys, but a strong embrace of beauty in life's most challenging moments. With each breath, each heartbeat and each fleeting moment, we are presented with the opportunity to discover the treasures of gratitude. Seneca's stoic legacy calls upon us to cherish the present, not because of life's difficulties, but because they allow us to appreciate the beauty that surrounds us. It is within this radiant practice that we uncover a profound and tranquil soul amidst life's turbulence. Lesson 9. Cultivate Resilience In the vast landscape of Stoic philosophy, the lessons of steadfastness resonate like a responsive symphony. And that is Epictetus, an outstanding Stoic philosopher. He spoke to teach us the profound art of facing difficulties with perseverance. For Epictetus, difficulties are not a formidable enemy, but a tool to sculpt the masterpiece of our nature. Stoic philosophy, deeply rooted in the natural order of life, conveys the fundamental truth that challenges are the threads and fibers of existence. Stoics have embodied this wisdom not considering difficulties as obstacles or sources of suffering, but instead as opportunities, a forge to heat and refine their inner metal. Epictetus calls upon us not to despair in the storms of life, but to stand firm like an unwavering oak tree in the face of the tempest. The essence of this stoic perspective lies in the profound awareness that it's not the event itself, but our perceptions reactions, and choices in the face of adversity that have the power to distress us. It is the lens through which we view life's challenges, shaping our inner tranquility. Cultivating steadfastness the Stoic way is steering the path of personal development and awareness, where adversity is not a calamity but a mentor. Stoic philosophy teaches us that in the forge of difficulties we discover our true strength. And through facing life's challenges with courage and unwavering perseverance, we emerge like steel that has been forged with a nature strengthened through the trials we have endured. The Stoic perspective on difficulties perfectly aligns with the Stoic belief in one's power of choice. Epictetus, in his wisdom, calls upon us to face challenges not with timidity, but with the courage of a warrior because it is through how we react to external events that we safeguard our inner peace and tranquility. It is the gift of steadfastness that allows Stoics to navigate through the turbulent sea of life with a steadfast gaze, unshaken even in the face of the strongest storms. Lesson 10. Keep learning and growing. In the profound landscape of Stoic philosophy, where wisdom is woven, from threads of patience and tranquility, we find a lesson that calls us to embark on a lifelong journey of self-improvement. Epictetus, one of the quintessential figures of Stoic philosophy, stands as a steadfast guide in this pursuit. He reveals that the path to inner peace and self-mastery is paved with the stones of personal development. The commitment of the Stoic to self-improvement is a recurring theme in philosophy resonating with empathy from various Stoic philosophers. Epictetus carries the torch of this lesson with persuasive determination. He invites us to step onto the endless path of growth, emphasizing that this commitment is a treasure of knowledge that equips us to face life's challenges with finesse and insight. At the heart of Stoic philosophy lies a profound awareness that life is an ongoing journey 
We are not static beings, but vessels of untapped potential, always capable of growth. The commitment to lifelong learning and development is an unwavering call. It is a reminder that wherever we stand, there are horizons to explore and virtues to cultivate. The Stoic's quest for self-improvement harmoniously aligns with the pursuit of wisdom and tranquility. It is an acknowledgement that tranquility and self-mastery are not static attributes, but processes enriched by continuous learning. Epictetus encourages us to strive for knowledge as we would seek a precious gem, knowing that it is the compass guiding us through the labyrinth of existence. The Stoic's journey of self-improvement finds its rhythm in the flow of urban life. We are called not to perfection, but progress, not to a static state, but steady development. This Stoic lesson echoes through the corridors of wisdom, whispering that there is no final destination, only an endless journey toward becoming a better version of ourselves. Embracing this lesson, we learn to face life's challenges with patience and strength. The Stoic spirit finds strength not in the absence of difficulties, but in the pursuit of growth that challenges often propel. We discover that failures are not barriers, but stepping stones, and every challenge is a teacher. The commitment to lifelong learning and development is a guiding beacon in the storm, a source of peace in the face of life's challenges. It affirms the Stoic principle that regardless of external circumstances, we are the masters of our inner world. The more we learn, the more we grow, and the better we become at facing life's storms. In the echoes of Epictetus's teachings, we find an invitation to celebrate the journey of self-improvement, to rejoice in the process of learning, and to honor the efforts of development. It is a lesson that affirms that with each step on this path, we draw closer to the heart of Stoic philosophy, a life marked by inner peace, self-mastery, and the pursuit of knowledge. In a world filled with turmoil and uncertainty, Stoic philosophy offers a timeless and practical guide to maintaining tranquility and self-control. By embracing these 10 lessons from Stoic philosophy, inspired by the wisdom of different Stoic philosophers, you discover a profound serenity and inner calm that help you navigate life's challenges. The enduring wisdom of Stoic philosophy reminds us that inner peace and self-mastery are not dependent on external circumstances, but are cultivated within through the practice of these invaluable lessons. If you have found even a hint of value from these 10 daily lessons, a bit of wisdom, or simply enjoyed our time together, consider subscribing to the channel, giving this video a big thumbs up and turning on the notification bell not for the sake of numerical goals, but to continue our dance of sharing knowledge and personal growth. Until our next uniquely magical encounter, keep the flame of curiosity burning bright and the spirit of stoicism alive. Goodbye and see you in the next video.